Hi, I'm Monique from Beats and Basics. Welcome to our series Jewelry Making Basic Techniques. And today I'm going to show you how you can finish your jewelry made with nylon cord. So that's just a normal beading wire that you use to make jewelry. Uh, you can use it to make bracelets or necklaces and I'm going to show you how you can actually finish it off with a clasp. So, you're going to need crimp beads. It's, these are these really small beads that you can like push together. Um, put a crimp bead on the wire. Put on your lobster clasp. And then take the wire and put it back through the crimp bead. And then you're going to push that all the way up to your clasp. And then you're going to close it with a plier. Make sure it's a flat plier. So you don't break the crimp bead. And then I usually take one or two beads and slide them back onto both of the wires. So just like this. And then you just cut off the excess wire with some scissors. So this is one side, you're going to put the lobster clasp and on the other side you're going to put a double loop ring. Which looks like this. So again take a crimp bead and then take your loop or your ring and then put the wire back through and just pull it so so it's tight and then close and again put the thread back through this is going to be maybe a little bit difficult but or not so like this and then you just cut it off here it's a bit more neat than if you're actually just cutting it off directly from here because then you will see the end of the thread and it's well, it's less neat so just put it back through one or two of the beads and that's how you can finish off your jewelry so it's the same for bracelets and necklaces obviously and it's a very nice way to finish off your jewelry um, if you want to make it so you can wear it in different lengths, example if you're selling jewelry, then not always, well you won't always know how big the jewelry actually has to be. So just take a piece of chain and put that on the double loop ring. So just open it. Like this. You can make it as long as you want. You can even put a small charm at the end if you like that. Just to make it more prettier. And now you can wear your bracelet on different sizes. So also for... You can use to have the same bracelet for people with a small wrist or a bigger wrist. And just put a piece of chain. And also for necklaces like this you can uh, wear it short or wear it long. It's just... Um, just the way you like. So this was um, one of the basics, how to finish off your old jewelry with a lobster clasp. I hope you uh, liked it, enjoyed it. And if you want to see more jewelry tutorials, just subscribe to our channel. So I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.